Guys, what's up? It's your boy TOJ. Let me jump into this video right quick. As you know, um, it goes without saying, opinions are like assholes. Everybody's got one, but I'm the asshole with an opinion. I uh, appreciate you guys for y'all joining me, watching, and, you know, uh, viewing in. So, tuning in. So, here we go. Dwight Howard, I don't know what was up with this dude, but there's been a rash of celebrity males, alpha male guys, you know, um, getting caught up. With transsexuals, like, I don't know, like, if y'all been noticing this lately, in news, uh, like, black news, it all comes in waves of threes. It's always, like, Cardi B whoop somebody ass, then Nicki Minaj whoop somebody ass, then 6 9 Takashi do something ignorant that's got something to do with Cardi B. You know what I'm saying? Like, like it's a month of ignorant shit, but it's all, like, it all comes in waves. And, and it's, like, Bobby Valentino had his situation, then... I think it's Young Buck. He had a situation. Then they got this one transsexual named Star something. And she always on, he or she is on Instagram always trying to like, like out somebody. What I don't get is that these dudes, man, are so thirsty. I don't get it. If you're a public figure, you got kids, you got, you're a celebrity. What the hell? Just go to Tough Love Dating YouTube channel. Fuck, go to my other YouTube channel, Tough Love Dating, and get you some game. I don't get it, bro. These dudes... I did a whole video like a year ago called How to Cheat on Your Girlfriend and Get Away With It. It got no views. But the point that I'm making is I'm a nobody with a lot to lose. And this guy is a basketball star with way more to lose than I do. I don't get these dudes, bro, who, just don't, who don't have enough game to, like, not get caught. Or, to, you know what I'm saying, to lay all this shit down. Now, for the most part, it, it, this particular transsexual guy or whatever, you know, prostitute or what have you, Already got a history of uh, ripping people off. Got a history of making fake stories up. And I think one of his his, his roommates got ripped off for $300 through a Craigslist ad of some type. Like he's selling a camera or whatever. So it, it's hard to tell if this dude is, is lying or not. But the perception and the recorded, you know, videotapes. I mean, the, the phone call saying, come on, you don't get like sucking dick or whatever he was saying. You know what I'm saying now? So my whole thing is live your truth. To be a thousand percent honest, that's really the whole gist of this video. I'm not, I'm not going to be here for a long time. But, <clears throat> excuse me, live your truth, bro. If you're moist, you like a couple of guys here and there. There's a couple of celebrities right now looking at how Lady Gaga is out, you know what I'm saying, doing all this weird shit. So there's a bunch of other, you know, celebrities that's out there talking shit that go both ways. And they just accept it. You know, even Madonna was like, yeah, I'm happily retarded. I do everything. I you know, Nicki Minaj is kind of like halfway bisexual. So, you know, and I, you know, if you're a black dude, yeah, black people don't really rock with the gay thing like talking about it. But at the end of the day, that's your life, man. And you, if you like men on the side, you know, you like, a, you know, a transsexual here and there. Just, you honor that shit, bro. That's the one thing I learned from Madonna. And not to make this a Madonna video, but I learned that from her a long time ago. She said, whatever you are, don't let the media d define it for you. You just, if you're going to be, you know, like, being crazy, just be crazy all the way. Go crazy before they can go crazy for you. And make and, and, and in the court of public opinion, the media is telling your narrative on your behalf. You say, yeah, yeah, fuck all that shit. I'm crazy. I love sucking a bag of this, and I like a bag of that in my house. And, you know, if it's, if it's coming out of your mouth, you take all the wind out of it. You take all the power out of it. So if you moist, just be moist. Fuck it. Say, yeah, bro, okay, I, I, I give up. I'm moist. I love it. I can't help it. I've been moist. Just like that, that dude who sang, Frank Ocean. Uh, I think Frank Ocean came out, and the fans are still rocking with him. R. Kelly was on tape being, you know, being moist. And, I mean, shit, the dude, his money, his money's still on lock. So, I don't know, bro. I, I, that's all I, I got. I'm getting mad. I didn't write a script for this video. I just think that the whole Dwight Howard shit, bro, is just out of control. And it, it's, it's going to sprout more legs if this dude... And, you know, like, don't really get out here. Because he, he hadn't made a statement yet. So if you don't get out there and address it, it's it's left up to us internet people or YouTube guys, you know, to give their opinion on the information that's available at this point in time. So I don't really have no details. So no details are coming out. And he ain't coming out to rebut it. But as far as my opinion on that shit, bro, if you moist, just fuck it, bro. Come out the closet already at this point. Anyway, um, hit like, share, and subscribe, and holla back.